Welcome to episode 1407, Jiang Lei, legendary venture capitalist from China. Nine lessons. This is an outline of episode 1407, lesson one to five. This is lesson six to nine. Lesson one: Leapfrog innovation for China. What is the single biggest opportunity? Lay. Well, innovation happens everywhere. Single biggest opportunity I would say is the opportunity to leapfrog. That you don't really have to replicate the traditional infrastructure. Take revolution. Take the payment, for example. China doesn't have to have all those traditional payment infrastructure. Look at WeChat Pay and Alipay. Essentially, you can do almost everything. You can walk away without your wallet. Lesson two: His funding and return records. Today, considered one of the most successful managers of funds in the world, since founding the company in 2005, with 20 million dollars of seed capital from Yale University endowment, Lei has grown Hill House funds to over 60 billion dollars in 15 years. Lesson three: the intern, the book, and the opportunity. After getting his MBA from Yale University, Jiang Lei became an intern for Yale Endowment. He also translated David Swanson's book into Chinese, and this created the opportunity. Lesson four: His mentor at Yale Endowment was David Swanson, who unfortunately died in 2021. Lesson five: Focus on the long term. So you are following something. Like the Swenson approach. Yes, absolutely. I think in the end, about that thinking about long-term orientation, that the, you know, the focus on the equity, focus on the、uh, residual free cash flow of the nature of the business, and focusing on risk-adjusted returns. So that six, the companies he funded. His venture capital investments and successes are too numerous to list. From Tencent to Meituan to Didi, etc. In seven, we are in innovation too now. Global innovation. If you look back, look at what I call innovation 1.0. That time, the innovation is all about connecting Baidu or Google. It's about connecting people and information. I think AI takes that to a totally new level because it's not just about connecting; it's about penetrating. Every part of our work and our life. Lesson eight: His dumbbell approach to investment. As an investor, we actually do it in what we call a dumbbell strategy. On one hand, we do invest in cutting-edge technology companies from early early stage investing company from Baidu, Tencent, JD. But on the other hand, last few years, we actually taking、uh, putting a lot of capital in traditional industries who are left behind. What called doomed? As a nine, as dumb and fundamental questions. 包括量子技术、基因免疫治疗等等。我是学文科的呀，呃，我我不是学这个，但是我觉得学文科给我们，我觉得有两个好处，实际上学高科技，没准比学高科技的人还有它相对优势呢。第一个就是说，你不被你的学科所局限；你第二个，你能用所谓的第一性原理，反正你没学过，你可以问最。最笨的、最傻的问题，没有人觉得你笨，反正知道你没学过，那你就可以问一些最基本的问题。Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.